This is part three in my first to ten battle with UKP Neptunes, the Dalsum player. Earlier I mentioned that sometimes I would do um, uh, demon flips uh, on unconfirmed jump-ins in, in order to keep pressure up. Another thing you can do is right here, uh, if you don't know if it's going to hit, uh, just combo into the fireball after the crouching fierce, it's pretty solid. You usually want to avoid comboing into, into palm or EX palm. Uh, when you don't know if it's going to hit because it puts you at a frame disadvantage and you can be punished afterwards. In this situation here, uh, the best finish would be to uh, hit him with uh, Tatsu after dash right there at the end instead of the palm. Uh, instead, I give him a chance to come back. Uh, but uh, something peculiar about Dawson is if you try to finish with a roundhouse Tatsu, the timing is actually a lot more difficult than other characters. Uh, so you will tend to, um, to get incomplete Tatsu quite a bit if you try that on Dawson. I'm going to try a cute little uh, trick in the corner here where uh, I, I try and air Tatsu as, as he rises. Um, if uh, they don't do a, a reversal or, or anything and, and they stand up into that uh, and try to crouch, it counts as an overhead hit and hits them, uh, similar to uh, Cammy's hooligan throw setup. Uh, if they block and then try to crouch, it does the same thing again. So uh, air Tatsu is actually kind of a fun little tool to play with. I'm going to miss the, the medium punch palm right here at the end of this combo. It's kind of testament to the kind of lag that, that we were playing in. Uh, it's very, very easy to finish that combo with medium punch palm, so you can tell that both of us are, are trying to do the best that we can. Here comes the whoops.
I'm able to secure the last game with that combo. Uh, thanks for playing with me, U UKP. I appreciate your help, man. If you're new to Gookin or um, to the Gookin versus Dawson match, I hope this helped you out. Thanks a lot, guys.